At the end of the arc, Neptune explains that Joy Boy was a person from the surface who lives during the Void Century. His message was for the mermaid princess living on the island at the time. It is an apology for breaking his side of a promise he made with the island. Neptune tells her he does not know the details of the promise, only that someday someone is supposed to come and carry out the promise made by Joy Boy. He explains it is a legend passed down in the royal family. Neptune says that their promise to Joy Boy was to watch Noah and keep it safe. Only when the promise time comes will Noah's purpose to be known. Robin asks Neptune if Joy Boy could control the sea kings. Neptune tells her that the ability belongs to the mermaid princess from then and now. Robin then concludes that Shirohoshi has the ability confirming her theory. She she then tells Neptune about the poneglyphs she read while in Skypia two years ago. It gave the location of one of the ancient weapons and said it was located on Fishman Island. She then asks Neptune if the mermaid princess from Joy Boy's time went by another name. Neptune starts to understand and begins to become fearful of what he's about to listen to. Robin tells him that Shirohoshi, by having the same ability, also inherited the same name as that princess. Her other name is the ancient weapon Poseidon. I don't write songs.